check your watch. I went through the refrigerator and pulled out a few things. I have a couple of small pieces of elk here and I'm gonna show you how to make a quick stir fry in real time. First, green onions, rough chop. Of course, whenever you're doing a stir fry, you wanna make sure you have all your ingredients chopped and ready to go before you start cooking. Here's some bell pepper. That was just some celery there. So far, I've got bell pepper, celery. This is pickled ginger. Here's some carrot. Didn't bother to peel them because it I don't mind the carrot skin on there. This is the elk loin. I'm gonna slice that very thin. It's gonna cook very quickly. If you had a little extra time, you could take this elk loin and put a little marinade on it, but the whole idea is to go quickly. Everything on a plate. The stuff that takes the longest time to cook would be like the celery and the carrots, so they'll go in first. Uh, Heck, I'll just put the bell peppers in at the same time. Um, there's the pickled ginger. I'll put the green onions in last. There's the meat. Now to the hot cast iron skillet. Olive oil. Celery, carrot, onion. I want the vegetables to be nice and crispy. I don't want soggy vegetables. This is not my grandmother's stir fry. Once that has a little color on it, I'm gonna throw in that elk. If you overcook your elk, it won't taste nearly as good. Here's some soy sauce, an American soy sauce. Of course, a lot of the soy sauces are made right here in the United States. Kikoman has a factory, has a plant in Folsom, California, my hometown. So there's the soy sauce, that's gonna be salt. I've got some rice vinegar, that's sour. For sweetness, I found this in the refrigerator door. This is a red pepper jelly, which will also um, give it a little bit of heat. And now a stir fry. We're talking about a minute or two. Again, you wanna cook it quickly. Once a little bit of color is out on that elk, your dish is done. Green onions. All right, check your watch. That is a quick elk stir fry. And I only spilled a little bit. See, how long did that take? 